crafters, welcome in to Guys Craft 2. My name is John. And I'm Curtis. And tonight, uh, we're actually doing a craft project. And this is all about Hallmark, all about our Hallmark movie channel. Because Curtis loves to watch Hallmark movies. No, you're the one that does. So, um, we downloaded this graphic that actually says, this is my Hallmark Christmas movie watching kit. And tonight, what we thought we would do is show you how we assemble and put some of these kits together. Yeah. All right. So with that said, the one of the things that I did do as a pre um, prior to, we ordered these bags off Amazon. Mm -hmm. These are really for us. We think they're the perfect size. We printed these. We downloaded this, uh, bought this design off Etsy, downloaded this, printed it. And I actually just use the double back scotch tape to tape each one into the bag. So that way, the clear bag, everybody knows what's going to be in there. But to start with, we each take a bag. And we bought some uh, red and white crinkle paper. What do you call this? Yeah, it's crinkle, crinkle like crinkle confetti. So, and the intent is just to put a handful or so in the bottom of the bag. And just enough to kind of get things going in there. Doesn't have to be a lot. Right? Yeah. And that gets, that's the first part of starting our bags. And then we found these. So, we just look for different things at different places, different stores. We happen to find these. I didn't realize we didn't take a price tag off those. Uh oh. So, um, we found these really cute glasses. What does it say? It says Christmas cheer and it has two wine glasses that are clinking. So, Curtis filled these up with chocolates and all that. What I would do if I was giving these probably to a friend is even look at buying one of those little bottles of. Um, wine that they make now. Mm -hmm. So you could give them a little bottle of wine and this. We, uh, just depends on how you gift these or give these away. Uh, these would be an amazing thing to sell at like a craft fair. Uh, if we were selling these, we would probably sell them at a $20 or so price point. Yeah. Uh, and I think they would completely walk out of the booth. Um, but we're giving these away for some of the, uh, we have some luncheons and things coming up and we're going to use these as just treats for the guests that show up. So first thing is the little wine glass with some chocolates and just a variety of candy. Next thing would be each um, each bag gets a pop secret popcorn as part of the gifts. Uh, next bag would get a thing of pistachios. And again, we're just looking for snacks and things that people can have as they're watching these Hallmark movies. and you know, things that will help them enjoy it. We actually found some of this Gold Bond hand cream. So we're dropping that in as well. We should put the socks in and put them in the middle. Oh, I thought we did already. Uh -huh. All right. Uh, the other thing that we bought was um, comfy curly socks. And so those are going in the bag as well. So you can see it's making a nice little bag. Nice little gift, nice little presentation. Doesn't have to break the bank uh, to make that. And then uh, we bought Kleenex. Oh, none of them are open. We bought Kleenex to drop in because you know how some of those Hallmark movies could be. They're just real tear jokers. And then are you able to reach? I have to go around the other side to get right. Can you get by yeah. me? Kind of. Yeah. Sorry, we didn't realize how far across the table we were making some things. So we actually bought Trident gum that will go in each bag. And we bought ice cubes, peppermint ice breakers. And again, just looking for things that will help make the bag colorful, make it look cute. As you can see now, I put the ice breakers, the gum, um, you got the pistachios, you've got the wine glass. So for a clear bag, these really start kind of decking out and looking 
pretty cute. So with that said, uh, we did buy a couple of things of Russell Stover candy that we are, are just dropping in. Some miscellaneous candy, some other Russell Stover's uh, mint patties. They get two of these? Yes. And so we dropped two of those in. Oh, I forgot about this. Uh, they get a couple of uh, packets of hot cocoa. Mm. So we don't necessarily need hot cocoa for a long time in, um, uh, in this part of the country, but other parts of the country, Hershey bars, they may want it. Um, and we bought Hershey bars. So again, you can't ever have too much chocolate. And is that everything? Mm. These. All right. And then we bought these melt away, uh, peppermints. And so just dropping a handful of those in as well. And see, so overall, it really makes a cute presentation, makes a complete full bag. And then, as you put this back together, we'll drop a little bit more, another little handful of confetti just on top to kind of even out the bag. So again, doesn't have to be much because you want to stretch it out. And then that closes off the bag. These bags have a really nice little snap to them. And then the front of your bag, obviously, is what? The um, Hallmark bag. Oh, and I forgot to cut these open. And then we found these um, reasonably priced ornaments. Oops. And so we bought these. And all I do is take a uh, hair protector. That one, right here, you can use this one. All right, can you get, grab another one? And I'll have to repair that one. And then all we do is take the ornament. And we bought these um, hair protector rubber bands because they, they just work perfect and they're clear. This one happened too. Oh, a whole bunch of them to fix them. All right, try a third one. All right. And then um, I just tie this on and pull it uh, through itself, right, to make it easy. That goes that way. And then I just grab one side of the bag and again do the same thing. And because it stretches nice and big, makes it pretty simple to do. And there you go. So there they is. walk away with an ornament. They walk away with the bag. And it really turns out to be a cute. And like I said, if we were selling these, I'd probably sell these for about 20 bucks. Yeah. And I think they would walk out of the craft booth all day long. So with that said, thanks for dropping in tonight. That gives you an idea of some of the crafting journeys. When we talk about doing different things, it's not always quilting. It's not always sewing. It's not making wreath kits. No. So we do a lot of things. We have a lot of interests. We do. With that said, thanks for dropping in tonight. You've landed in Guys Craft 2. If you like what we did tonight, give us a thumbs up. Always hit that subscribe button. We're at almost 370 subscribers. That's just amazing to us. Just awesome. That. Yeah, thank you. And we appreciate that. Anything yeah. else? No. No comments? No, nothing from me. Not tonight. All, All right. right. Thanks for tuning in. Happy crafting.